Okay, here it is. When she says, I love you, she's saying, I love you for what you're doing for me. I love you for how your presence in my life is making me feel. And I love you for creating what I wanted in my life. It's not like your mother saying, I love you. Actually, you rarely hear your mother saying, I love you. She shows it. She says, how are you feeling? Have you eaten? You're not feeling well? Do you want me to make you chicken soup? That's real love. Romantic love is what you're doing for me. What have you got for me? What have you done for me? I love you. When she says I love you, listen, I want to believe in the fantasy as much as you do. I want to believe that it's real as much as you do. But truth is something else. The moment you free yourself from fantasy and the moment you see things for what they really are, that's when you try to be free. And when the reality hits, and it always does, just a matter of time, you will be hurt a lot less, if any, but more so you will understand where it's coming from. You won't be uh, woken up from a, a fantasy. I thought you were my friend. I thought you were my soulmate. I thought you were uh, my everything. I thought I was your everything. No, 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 no. You'll thank me later. Just keep that in the corner of your mind. Enjoy the romantic relationship that you're in. Enjoy it while it lasts, because it never does. Enjoy it as long as it's there. Be good to each other. But realize, when she says I love you, it only means I love you for what you're doing for me. That's why when you stop doing that, when you do something that turns her off, when you say something that uh, goes against what she likes, she'll move on to the next guy and she'll say, I love you to the next guy and the next and the next and the next. It's not you. It's what you're bringing to the table for her. It's the offer on the table. This is not coming from a place of bitterness. It's not coming from a place of anger. It's not coming from a place of uh, misogyny or not liking women. I love women. I have them in my life. I respect them. I cherish them. I treat them like a lady when they deserve it. But I don't lose sight of reality. Every time you set foot on an airplane, thank God the chances are low, but hey, you got to realize there is a chance. <laughs> Don't kid yourself. All I'm trying to do is to make you get hurt less or not at all when it all comes crashing down. So remember next time a woman in a, in a romantic setting says, I love you. That just means I love you for what you're doing for me. We miss the most simplest things. The Japanese say, the easiest place to hide is directly under the light because that's the last place people will look. And the simple bare truth is also the last place people will look in realities like this. Sometimes we even know it, but we don't want to look at it. So remember it next time someone says in a romantic setting, I love you. Just the fact that it ends and uh, sadly, it always does, should be hard proof to you. All the best.